So everyone, welcome to the Power we'll Play with CJ Twenty Focus in on the Buffalo Sabers re-signing Marcus Foligno to a one-year deal worth two point two five million dollars. Pretty fair deal, I think. Um, you know, he's a really solid bottom six forward for them. And I mean, could he grow into something more? Yeah, but I think he that role is pretty good for him given the amount of uh, young talent they have. You know, he's able to effectively kind of open up space with his physicality and uh, size and you know, chip in some, some points here and there. So, again, I think he's a good fit on that team in the role that he has. And, uh, you know, again, I think he, he embraces, you know, what he is with Buffalo. Obviously, in fact, his dad played up there. It's kind of a pretty cool thing, and they, they're both kind of folk heroes. So, um, you know, again, he's uh, just, again, I, I keep saying it again. It's like Herb Brooks right now. Uh, just a really solid fit with this team, you know, because he, he does the little things that help you in hockey games. And, uh, you know, I just want to point out that his brother Nick didn't have his first really good offensive season until he was, I think, 25 as well. So, hey, maybe it runs in the family. When you hit 25, you, uh, you start to break out offensively. So that's just something I observed and threw out there. Throw it out there see what comes back. But uh, wouldn't shock me if he had, you know, 12 to 15 goals next year and really was a, uh, you know, underrated part of Buffalo being, a, I think, a surprise team in the East. I'm not saying Buffalo will be in the playoffs next year, but I think they've got the pieces to definitely make some improvement. Um, you know, obviously, I think the young players will be better. You add a guy like Kyle Pozo and, you know, retaining glue guys like Felino, I think, helps you. So, you know, see what happens. Anyway, that's all I got. So, to the power play with CJ. Stay tuned for more episodes throughout the offseason and beyond. Well, later, guys.